right, so we're going on a little trip to Gyeongbokgung today. So, today is a beautiful day. I get to come to the palace to make a video. Now, I'm not here to do the usual touristy shit everyone else does, but there's clouds in the sky. And when there's clouds in the sky, that means you can take very nice pictures. So, here I am. Let's do this. I've already actually made a video about this place, but like I said, we're here to take pictures. Um, usually here, you see like the changing of the guards. It's like something happens every so often. People get really excited. Uh, I don't actually know why, it's not that interesting, but if you're lucky enough, I guess, you can see the changing of the guards and guards just walk around and people cheer, you know? That's kind of what happens. This place usually gets packed. Right now you can see the sky is really nice. So we're gonna take some awesome pictures. People often ask me, when's the best time to come to Korea? And I'll tell you this, it ain't spring. It definitely ain't winter for hell. And summer blows for the sheer humidity. So in my opinion, the best time to come to Korea is uh, Probably late summer and fall. Spring sucks because there's so much pollution in the air, it's so dusty. The, the, the sky is like, uh, how can I say? It's pretty much yellow every day and gray. And the dust just hurts your lungs. It's, it's horrible. I mean, sure, you can see pink blossoms, purple blossoms, whatever for about a week before they all die uh, but the rest of the time if you ain't careful, the dust is gonna make your lungs explode in your chest and uh, it really hurts your throat so there's that summer sucks because it's well, the dust is still there for the most part but now you've got like humidity and all this shit it's terrible and then late summer you have the rainy season which I guess that would suck if you're a tourist, but for me, like I'm a photographer, so I like I like clouds. Plus the, the air cleans up a little bit more. And then fall is just plain beautiful. But you don't want to come winter. Winter is horrible. So. But if, I guess if you want to come to Korea, you don't really have much of a choice to when you can come. Then you're gonna enjoy either way. Now we've reached one of the photography spots like they open the palace at night every so often so usually right there you have like a hundred photographers trying to take a picture but since it's not palace at night no one is here I think you can get a nice infrared picture right now so we're gonna go ahead and try and do that before tourists come and see me so let's do that finally got to my destination it's one of my favorite day pictures uh, despite all the tourists but uh, I found out my fisheye lens doesn't work with my infrared camera so I'm gonna go with the next best thing anyways here's where I am I think you guys will enjoy the view it's quite beautiful I can actually see what you guys see because um, I don't have a live view on this GoPro, but as you can see, it's quite nice. Beautiful, isn't it? And you got the tourists and the people wearing hanboks that will never wear them again. So yeah, that's why I say you should come to Korea late summer or fall. Don't come in the spring, it sucks. Don't come in the winter for sure. And don't come in the summer, summer part. 
anyways that's all i hope you guys enjoyed this video this is usually what i do i go out and i take pictures and yeah please follow me on instagram um, you guys can see all the kind of photography i take 